one person doesn't define whole God on the years. Okay guys, so welcome back to the channel once again and guess what, we met this wonderful foreigners here also exploring the uh, Tafu um, Monkey Sanctuary and Cultural Center. Okay? So we want to have a little chit chat with them, know where they are from and what they think about Africa. So welcome to our channel. Thank you. Thank you welcome to Africa. Thank you. Is, is this your first time in Africa? For me, it's the first time. This is my first time. No, I've been to Togo. Togo? Okay. How was Togo? Uh, different. Different. Okay. Okay, before we get there. Yeah, before we get there, uh, can we know their names right here? My name is Dinka. And my name is Max. From? Belgium. No, oh, Belgium. <laughs> okay, so. I'll uh, tell you, do you like football? Yes. Do you know Lukaku? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Lukaku, you guys know Lukaku. You know why I'm saying Lukaku. The guy behind a lot of mysteries. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we'd like to know um, what you think about Africa before coming. Since this is your first time, yes. and also what you also had about Africa before coming. What did you know about Africa? Uh, we didn't know much, uh, so it was real new. Um, but we, we were ready to see how it was. Uh, we want the whole experience. <laughs> that, that's nice. You had the same feeling too. Yes. Okay. yes. That's amazing. So it's like they came with an open mind to learn. Yes. 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 Were you afraid of getting infected with malaria? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, you see, you see, it's still, it's still a concept, but hey, we, we have it. It's never like that. Okay. When you come here, there are there are better stars down here. So I think you can attest to that. Yes. Yeah, there yes. are better star stars over here. Also. Yeah. So. Uh, how long have you been in Ghana? Three months. Three months? Yes. Oh, okay. Then that should be on a mission. Yes. yes. Okay. I think that would be a private thing, but have you been to any tourist site outside this monkey Uh Yes, we've been to Pecos. Pecos Pass? Yes. Okay. And how was the place to you? How do you feel? It was very interesting. Yes. We learned a lot about the place. Okay. Did you get emotionalized at the point? At certain times, yes. When you get the stories and when you see the places, you can see how people live there, what they've been through, and it's like, wow. So what, what came in mind? You see yourself in the ocean, what came in mind? Like thinking like, you being there, seeing those caves that people were in there, what came in mind? How did you feel? Yeah, it was really hard. Yeah, it was Yes. And we also saw the door of no return. The door of no return, okay. But this time we were to return. Yeah, we yes. <laughs> so it's not a door of return. Okay, so. Okay, so. <laughs> concerning this malaria thing that you told you, you yourself infected with malaria and all that, are you experiencing that now? Since you came, you've been here for three months. Yes. Have you had any malaria? No. <laughs> okay, so. What would you tell people? You thought you got some malaria and all sort of uh, diseases, but you can attest you've not had anything like that. Mm -hmm. And do you think people out there should be having that mindset when coming to Ghana or Africa? Mm -hmm. Do you think they have to have that mindset that, oh, Africa, you get malaria, you get this kind of sickness, so don't go? Would you, do you think you, would you tell them not to come to Africa? No, no, no. They just have to take. And be careful. Also. Yeah. yeah. You know, actually, um, it's like going to even a white man's land. If you are not careful, you end up yes. falling into so much. Yes. And best. Exactly. Okay. So yes. everywhere you go to, just need to be careful. It's not like okay, Africa is so bad. Africa is not that bad. Africa is a good place. Like yeah. if you want a good place of culture, mm -hmm. religion. Okay, respect. Respect. yeah, respect yes. yeah. Yes. Yes. Welcoming Ghanaians, I know. I don't want to talk for myself, but I know Ghanaians are very welcome. Yes, yes. very yes. friendly. Yes. They always want to help. Yes, wow. yes. yes. They, they told me that they came here for intention. Okay, yes. and they said they were having an intention at Sunday. Okay. And you know, Northerners are very friendly. Yes, they will are cook for you. Yeah. I'm yes. an Ashanti, but when it comes to Northerners, yeah. I always want to be around them because I'll eat. <laughs> <laughs> and I there's so much of positive energy. Yes. Mm -hmm. So much yeah, of Did you learn any dance over there? Yeah, we're not good at it. <laughs> uh, no, 
Go bold class. Okay, okay, okay. But did you learn any language? Yeah, yeah bully. Bully and tree. Tree. Yes. Okay, let's speak the tree. The bully. Mm, <laughs> let's speak the tree. So, but you're better in bully. <laughs> You see, she is taking me to bully, and I'm taking her to cheat. Okay, I don't know what bully is about, but she has already she has done well because she knows two languages. I know of just she, and you know I know problems with chi at the same. Yeah. Ah. You know it's a popular. That's simple. But you know, even in Ghana, even in the northern sector, okay, there are so many languages over the place. Yes. Okay, they're not known because I was there for a couple of months. And there was this language at a particular place. As soon as you move from there, it's a different language. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yes. So they have so many languages. Yes. They say it's good. Okay, so let's come to uh, this place. How do you see the place? This monkey sanctuary. How do you see this place? It was very nice. Yeah, it was very yeah. nice. Okay. So before, did you used to like monkeys? Yes. Me personally, my experience, I never loved monkeys. <laughs> yeah, one of those animals. <laughs> They will throw shit at you, throw stones at you. They will just do nasty stuff that you just want to feel happy. Then you will feel sad. So I, I never liked monkeys. But coming here today, feeding them, they coming close to me, I feel very cool. Like I never knew they, they were this nice. So what do you think about coming here and experiencing or feeding these animals? I've never got a chance to be so close with a monkey oh. than here. So now they were jumping on my head, on my shoulders when I was feeding them, and it was so cool. Wow. Really, yeah. Okay, it was and nice. for me, I never saw monkeys. Wow. And they were very friendly. Yeah. 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 They, they were very friendly because there was one called Grandpa. I don't know whether. Yes. Yes. Grandpa, <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Have you even heard of? Uh, popular saying that monkeys play by sizes. Yes, yes, yes. When they were eating the small yes. ones, yes. Yes, yes. we saw it, we saw it. Okay, so, <laughs> guys, so, uh, as you can see, we are having a good time with our Belgium uh, uh, like friends. That's what I call it because we are very friendly. And I can see they are having a good time in Ghana. They've been here for three months from Sandema to Accra to Volta. You can see Ghana is very free. No restrictions, no one will be asking you questions, no immigration, those kind of pressure you get from other countries, like you being a tourist or something like that. Ghana is very, a very friendly country and we are open minded. And we no one love the foreigners more like you. Yes, we are that kind of people. We are not ready to hurt anyone and we are really in for the positive ones. Okay, Everywhere you go across the world, you see the bad, you see bad ones. And you can't just be mentioning or feeding people with the bad energy that I went here, someone did this thing to me, so because of that they are all like that. No. You just have to be doing individual things because if you are to slap me, that doesn't mean the whole of Belgium are like that. You get it? If I'm to insult you, that doesn't mean the whole of Ghana is like that. You have to be seeing it from a lot of them that is like, oh, this particular people are like that. So one person or two people, within millions of people, you can't just be like, they are all like that. So I think you have to come to Ghana. Okay, so before we even go there, what would you tell your friends out there? People outside Ghana who want to come in to do their internship or even visit Africa, what would you tell them? Those that are afraid, they think maybe I'm gonna end up being robbed, end up being beaten by people or even getting myself into a whole lot of bad things so I don't even want to go there. What would you tell them? I would totally recommend coming here. Yeah. Um, yeah. Just have to be open-minded and see what it is. Sometimes you have to take risks with everything you need. Yes. I agree. And I agree with what you said. Like, one person doesn't define whole Ghana. So, yeah. Yeah.